Journey, the Tower Grove campus, celebrating awesome guy, uh, DJ Air, also known as Eric Brown, who was um, just one of those great guys that loves to encourage other people. Uh, when I moved to St. Louis here about 11 years ago, JR was uh, performing at an event and he was the DJ for it. And that was actually one of my first times actually um, really meeting a Christian DJ and just seeing other artists that did this Christian R&B, you know, style type thing. And I was like, wow. And I remember him always being just so super supportive. And this was years before I had even started to get into, you know, music. He just really encouraged and loved people. Um, and so it's been a year since he passed away. Um, and so here, we're here tonight, there, um, the whole community, the, um, several of his family and friends, his wife, uh, we're, we come to encourage her just through music and through community and through fun and all that stuff. And so this is awesome. So this is something, we just finished our sound check and you got a chance to see some of the footage from that. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, kind of hang around for a bit before the actual show starts tonight. So my boy Ian is back there holding it down on the camera. Love you guys, be back, peace. Hey, Anybody else that would like to also? Hey, what up with it, man? I am very tired. It's been a long day. And anybody that's worked today understands, Hello, right? Hello, somebody. <laughs> However, man, we're excited, man. Um, in memory of our brother, E, if you knew him, yeah. we always say he one of them dudes, if somebody didn't like E, it was an issue with the person that didn't like him and not E, you know what I mean? I can understand somebody not liking me, but he's just a likable guy, you know what I mean? So, uh, we're thankful to be here, excited about the night, although my face and my continence might not express that, trust me, my soul is has plenty that's of That's a real joy. deal right here, when you talking like that, that's a real deal, you know what I'm saying? So man, God bless, get ready, we gonna get it in, it will not be a somber night, we will Rejoice tonight. We will enjoy tonight. Awesome. Let's get it. Oh, uh, what you looking forward behind to? the scenes. This B-roll. This behind the scenes B-roll right here. All right, awesome. I'm Rhino, that drummer. Uh, God is good. We here for um, Courtney Orlando's homeboy Eric. The last Legacy concert, man. So it's gonna be awesome turnout. Got Jay, King Shields, Courtney Orlando, my big brother, big homie Thizzle. Um, you got this cool guy back here. Being Mr. Mr. Smooth, so, but yeah, glory be to God, man. Oh, Jason, let's get it. So, so this is this is okay. on the other side. She said, yeah, we take care. Still trying to figure that out. Okay. okay. Cool. Well, well tomorrow something else comes up, but I'm gonna try to There's make no this. Okay. And, and Hold it. Well, yeah. I cut the yeah. phone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> it's like too much. I'm this. <laughs> Biscuits, baby. Biscuits. Biscuits. You hear me? My brother makes biscuits. You came home. If you come home, I, I meal plan for the long term. Yeah, and that is I need to be on that line. We really are not in baby mode. That's usually how we are. Yeah, so we. So I'm trying to do it before the baby. Before the baby comes so she was. is 
Beard Oil. Beard Oil. And the name of the company is Beard Tastic. And this guy is one of the masterminds behind it. And so what I wanted to do is just introduce my brother and my friend Matt Swearjo to the company, to the world. Um, this is some stuff. If you have a bearded guy in your life, he needs to have a bottle of this. And this is actually my favorite one right here, Urban Timber. He just happened to bless me with a bottle of this tonight. And let me tell you how God works. I left my bottle at home, and I was like, man, I wish I had some beard oil. Can't do that. There it is. It's here tonight, guys. And I'm actually going to use this. Now, I don't want to be too graphic and just go into the restroom and show you how this is done. But this will be used on tonight. So, Matt, you, you want to do it? Let's do it. <laughs> okay. So, one of the appropriate ways on how to use beard oil, of course, you have to take it out of the wrapping first. Now, technically, as I was told, you would use this when you were coming out of the shower. Is that correct, That's Mr. Right. Swearingen? Yep. Okay, so I just get a little a little moisturization going here on the beard itch. Okay, then he helps me out a little bit right there, okay? And then, crack open that bottle. Got a little extra wrappage right there, okay? Make sure it's safe. Don't be alarmed. You're like, why is the camera in the restroom? <laughs> <laughs> and here it is, bam. Just try to see what funky business y'all up to. <laughs> <laughs> I know he's like, what is going on over here? And that is beard oil. Can you catch the shine? Can you catch the smoothness, the richness, the aroma of Beardtastic Urban Timber? You can go to Beardtastic.com. Get Beardtastic.com. Beard and on Twitter. And on Twitter. And on, Twitter. And on Instagram. And Facebook. And this is what we do. And all day. And actually, we're going to make sure some other guys get this. So that's all for that. That's all. <laughs> It's intermission. We're getting ready to go up next. Excited to be here at the journey. Um, we are in the green room. Are my peoples? Are my peoples? Have you guys met everybody? You guys haven't met everybody. Matt Banks on trombone, making a do what they do production. Dr. Harvey Lockhart, professor, that's what we call him. The Dr. Philip Graves. Man, we got a lot of doctors in this house. Uh, this guy right here, Ryan, on camera. <laughs> Be folks. No explanation needed. <laughs> Keisha holding it down. Keisha Whittier holding it down. Lloyd. What's up? I'm Lloyd. No. <laughs> but uh, Ryan somewhere. But um, I I, I did I did the time. I'm Penny the Shields, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Kelly Scholarship. Yeah. Yeah. Courtney Orlando, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Yeah. I study. I, 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 and you ready to go? Huh? Which one? Okay. Yeah, don't find my mic.
just got finished. That's what you love, man. It's so crazy because a lot of times, you know, you write songs, you think they're just for you, but like, just to feel what I feel, what other people are feeling out there right now. It's a special moment. So thank you guys for sharing this with me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's it.